Hello everyone, this is Hammertron here with a new review video for you. This time I am reviewing the Safari Limited Wild Safari Lowland Gorilla. This is set number 282829. This figurine was first molded in 2006 and I bought this in a store sometime during 2018 or 2019. When I bought it, it came with a tag wrapped around its back right leg. It was wrapped around this plastic and it had a warning card in English and some other languages. And here is the tag. Lowland Gorilla from Safari Limited under their Wild Safari series. Some basic information inside and manufacturing information on the back. Let's take a look at the dimensions of this figurine. It is about four and a quarter inches long. I think the snout is just a little bit farther ahead than the front leg. At the widest point it looks like about two and a quarter inches wide. And at the highest point It looks like a little bit between three and a half inches and three and three quarter inches tall to the top of the head there. Let's take a look at the sculpting detail. Now I like how there's a lot of fur sculpted throughout the whole body in the arms, the side, the leg there, and the head and across the back yes everywhere uh, even on the buttocks there so no fur on the face there well maybe some on the chin there the shoulders nothing on the chest there and some fur on the belly. Now on the belly it has some manufacturing information 2006 made in China and it says gorilla male so this is a male gorilla. Now I do like all the detail in the bottom of the feet here. They took the time to sculpt some detail on the individual toes and on the, the sole of the foot there some nice detail on the fingers here or even some of the fingers are well almost separate not quite separate but the thumbs are a little separate very nice now it's a male gorilla but apparently it's a young gorilla because it doesn't look like it's a, a silverback or any gray coloring. Now gorillas have an interesting uh, head profile, an extra ridge on top of their head where more muscles and tendons are are anchored to the head to give their jaws more power. So that's nice. Now if we look at the eyes we can see that they're just a bit glossy or they're painted with a glossy paint to to make them shiny and show that they're moist. So that's nice. However, it looks like just a little bit extra was added to the eyebrow here. Maybe just a mistake. Now what's interesting is it looks like this male gorilla has a bit of a belly here. Now, um, 
A while ago, I posted a video with some pictures and short video clips of my trip to the zoo, and it looked like the gorillas were very lean. So, much leaner than this one, so they didn't have any bellies. So, either they were young or they just had a better diet than this one did. Now, I'd like to compare this with another gorilla that I have already re reviewed on this channel. The Safari Limited Gorilla. Now, this one was labeled just as Gorilla. This one is labeled as the Lowland Gorilla. So, this one had a smooth back and looks like it was painted to be gray or silver there. So they're both male gorillas, but this one here is much larger than the first one I had reviewed. So there it is. This is the Safari Limited Wild Safari Lowland Gorilla. Thank you for watching my video. Please like the video, leave a comment, and subscribe to my channel to keep up to date with my future reviews. Until next time, goodbye everyone.